Are you just going to see how Barara looks like? What are the objectives of your going there? You are, first of all, you are building relationship with other Ugandans. And you are going to pick what they learn. You are, they, we call it benchmarking in technical terms. What are they doing that we are not doing here in Dubai? So you should go there knowing exactly what you want to learn from them. Then you come back and re implement. If what you are doing is better than theirs, then you enhance. Okay? Like I'm telling you, we are the best regulator on the continent, and we don't want to leave that position. We are now looking for how to sustain position number one in Africa. So please, as young people, love your country. Be patriotic. Love Uganda. There is no better country than your country, that. I've traveled different countries in the world, but I've not fallen in love with any other country apart from Uganda. It's a very beautiful country. God has endowed us with human beings who are the best. So love your country and work towards promoting this country. I know I, I came late, but you will forgive me for that because I was somewhere else meeting other people and this invitation became very late because I've already programmed other activities. But I want to thank you. communication. How do you communicate? How do you talk to your colleagues? How do you talk to elders? How do you talk to your classmates? To your schoolmates? Communication is very important today. Even if you get the best grades, if you don't know how to communicate, how to talk to others, how to respond to others when they have a problem, then you are going to fail. I am an employer. We employ people. We recruit people. One of my employers is here. He broke documents for me to sign. Even if you have a first class degree, as long as you are, we call them soft skills. Those people relationship skills. If they are not good, we don't give you a job. If we give you a statement and we realize you can't relate well with other people, we dismiss you. It is very important that you do that. As young people, you need to respect those who are older than you. For us, when we were young, we could not allow an elder to carry a heavy uh, luggage when you are walking say, from school to home. I don't know that you do that today. So please, this clip is very important. If you are not, we need people who solve problems of society. You see, you are here as Red Cross. You are contributing to humanity. You are solving problems. You are helping those who need help. It's very important to give for others. When you help others, you benefit as a person, even if you don't have money. By volunteering to give your time, your energy, it's very important. Some of us are aging and we are looking at you as